Hi you guys and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. So today I have some new products from Vanilla Co. Do you want to know what's in my box? Stay tuned. Alright you guys, so I just received this box from Vanillico. They did send me this for review, so thank you so much for sending me some of your new products to test out. I can't wait to see what's in here and to try them out for you guys. So it just came in this box right here, and what was down inside are some goodies. Let's go ahead and see what's in here. Okay, so this is what is down inside of the box. Now I have reviewed the products before and I've actually purchased products from them and gotten them in different subscription boxes. So I've used quite a few things from Vanillico and everything that I've used is just amazing. I really love all of the skincare products that I have used. And now all these are green boxes. Most of them are all pink boxes. So I'm so excited to try something new because I've never used anything in a green box. So this says clean at zero, pore clarifying foam cleanser. So that's what this one here is. Directions are to wet your face and apply the cleanser with your fingertips, massaging gently and avoid contact with the eye area. Rinse thoroughly with lukewarm water. So let's get this opened. And that is what it looks like on the inside. I'm so excited to try this. I, do, I did use the pink one that was a cleanser kind of like this and I really enjoy it. So now I can't wait to try out this one. So there's that guy. Then the next thing we have is the same line. And this one says it's a cleansing balm. So on the top of this one, it does come with this little divider you can put on the top. And then it has a little scooper outer for you to use. And here is what this looks like. And you guys, the pink one is the only one that normally, there's only like two ever that'll take all of my makeup off. And this is one of them. So I'm so excited to try now the Tri Peel Acid Blend to see how that works, but I'm sure it's gonna work just as good. So let's see on the inside as a seal. And there's the balm right there. And you guys, a little tiny bit goes a long way. I literally, I don't use the scoop to be honest. I just stick my finger in there because I do that right before I get into the shower to get all of my makeup off. It literally takes everything off. My mascara, my eyeliner, everything when nothing else really does. So I just dip in and get a little tiny bit, like warm it up between my hands, spread it all through my eyes, work it in, work it through my eyelashes. And then I use a makeup eraser and it's all gone. So I love this stuff. And then this one right here says, these are pore clarifying toner pads. I really have been enjoying the toner pads. It's so much easier than having to like put it on something. And I don't know, it just seems so much easier to grab one and then just wipe it over your face. So I'm really excited to get these. Oh my gosh, they give you little plastic tongs. <laughs> I've never seen that before. Look at how freaking cute is that? So in this one, you can put this on the top and then <laughs> And then you have little tongs to pull them out. <laughs> that is freaking cute. Oh my goodness. So here is the packaging. Little tongs. Like I've, ne <laughs> I've never, I got to take those out. I'm going to see, I'm going to take it out with those. <laughs> so you can put this right on top and that'll keep them moist. And when you want to pull it out, there's this little lever. There's a little Hank handle thing there. You just use that to lift it straight up. And then you can use your handy dandy tongs to reach in and grab one out. That is so cute. Oh my gosh. I, this, these little tong situation is the cutest. <laughs> so there's that. So that's really cool because now I can use the cleansing balm because that's normally what I do is use a cleansing balm first and then in the shower I will use a cleanser. So I'll use this as my cleanser and then I'll get out and then this will be my toner. So for these three steps is covering most of my skincare regimen every day anyway so i'm really excited to use these so i'm gonna go in and test them out and i'll be back to finalize okay you guys so now i am back to finalize using these three products right here so let's start off with the first step the first step would be the cleansing balm this cleansing balm works exactly the same way of the other the pink box that i buy all the time and i really really love so it's the same type of formula it just has a little bit different it's Part of this like green box line this one is called the tri peel acid and all of them have that on there 
So with this one, I would use a small little amount like normal and I'd rub it between my fingertips to let the oils kind of warm it up. And then I rub it over my eyes and I work it into my eyelashes and it completely removes all of my eyeliner, all of my mascara, all of my makeup. And then I use a makeup eraser just to clean everything off. That's how I wash my makeup off every single night actually is by using a cleansing balm. There's only two brands that I actually use and this is one of them and I constantly am rebuying both brands because I really like them. So this works amazing just like all of their cleansing balms. It just works really really good. It breaks down all of your makeup and it leaves you with a clean fresh face. So then using the actual cleanser, this cleanser, it actually smells a little bit like a tea tree oil. So when I'm cleansing my face, I kind of feel like it's working a little bit harder or at least differently than the other one that doesn't have a scent to it because I am smelling that tea tree oil. I just feel like it's getting a deeper cleanse. I don't know if that's true or not because it's still like a... It works the same way, but with that tea tree oil, to me, I just feel like it's getting more of a deeper or a different type of a cleanse, but I really, really enjoy this, and it's not too, too strong of a scent of the tea tree, um, so I actually really do enjoy this cleanser. And then when I get out of the shower, you guys, I absolutely love those little tiny tongs. I feel so bougie pulling out the little lid and using my little tongs to grab one little tiny pad to use. Some toners that I've got when they're the actual little pads like this, there's not enough liquid on it that where I would have to use like two or three different ones. With this one, I am okay with just using one. So I'll use my little tongs and I'll grab out just one little tiny pad and that is enough to go cover my whole entire face and then I just use my night serum or moisturizer cream whatever I'm using afterwards but I really really like the toner it doesn't have that tea tree scent to it but it does tone your face and it just leaves you feeling nice and clean and just it feels nice once you're done with all of these steps so I'm so glad that they sent these to me so now I can try this green line because again, all I was using was the pink one before and repurchasing the pink. So now I can at least use this and start using this line as well. love Vanilla Coast products, especially when you get to the cleansing balm and the cleansers. So this is my go-to to clean my face pretty much every single night. So I really am glad that now I have a new line of theirs to start using you guys. So I will link everything down below if you would like to check them out. All of their products are just amazing. So that is everything that I have to show you guys. Comment down below. Let me know. Have you ever tried any of these products? Have you heard of their cleansing balm? This stuff is amazing. You guys comment down below your positive interaction it means the world. And I greatly do appreciate it as I greatly appreciate every single one of you guys. So until next time, you know, the drill, keep a smile on that gorgeous face of yours and I'll see you on the next one. Bye crafty crew out.